losing mad followers because she said that she don't believe that her fans should call themselves kittens. A few while back that she got a tattoo that allegedly was on some sick, twisted demise and then responds. And we don't know you, but we have supported you through thick and thin. Woo! This fan is pissed off. Mind you, you'll be nothing without us. Time out. Um, I want to stop the fan. I mean, I did agree to a certain extent. Like, your fans are the reason why, you know, you're... you're successful youtube it's your girl tt chanel like velcro got that lala carmelo go dumb like weirdos i block me on fiddles in the neighborhood i can't go i'm hot marshmallow i'm hot marshmallow it is reaction video time more like putting y'all up on game now um shout out to doja cat as you can see, she's been on one lately. Like, um, I got this video from her Instagram. I was just looking for footage. And I just had to share this because, like, what's happening here? Um, anyway, hit that subscribe. Let's get back into the video. Wow. Um, thoughts and prayers to Doja Cat. She's been on one lately. Like, she's really been on one lately. Um, I, me personally... I've never seen no one act like this toward their fans since like Eminem. Like back in the day, Eminem was on one when it came to his fans. Like, love love. what's wrong don't, with you? Don't, 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 baby. We got love for her. I'm Fuck saying that. you gotta, you gotta keep it peace with everybody in here. Everybody in this motherfucker is trying to perform. You know what I'm saying? Peace, Everybody's trying to get on. Hold you on, know? If, if we don't Yo, brawl, we don't I wanna say peace I'm to my cool. man. I wanna say his lyrics remember he was like at least have the decency to if you see me feeding my daughter and stuff like that don't take a picture which is totally understandable totally understandable but like you just never heard an artist actually address their fans in such a negative light since like eminem you know what i'm saying like fans will get you into some shit like shout out to Nicki minaj but um barbs be getting Nicki into some shit you know what i'm saying like they'll say something and Nicki would like it and then now boom she is some shit um, fans get used to some shit. Shit. Um, shout out to Young Boy. Um, his fans ride for him, and he ride for them. He's never put them in their place and been like, "Yo, chill, y'all wildin' with all this YB better stuff." He fucks with it, and you should support your fans. So as far as this whole Doja Cat thing goes, I'm kind of like me being a Libra. I'm on a balance. You know, I feel like. You should check your fans if you, they feel like, you know, they're getting out of hand. And, then, and I also feel like your fans are your number one supporter. Without them, there is no you. I mean, is Doja Cat, not every song you put out there is perfect, you know. But your fans are still going to like those songs that's not perfect. So the fact that she's going off on her fans is crazy. I want to show you guys. Where is it? Here it goes. This picture right here. Okay. So I want to get into this. Now, this is when Doja... Well, she already started losing mad followers because she said that she don't believe that her fans should call themselves kittens. And, you know, her fans totally disagreed with it. they like, listen, that's the name that we came up with. That's the name that we're riding with. So fuck you if you don't like it. Um, Shout out to um her fans who stood up for themselves. Doja Cat, she tweeted, My life, my rules, my style, my attitude. A fan said, I want to hear you say, I do love you guys as usual, you say to your fans. I don't, though, because I don't even know y'all. Like, she said this to her fans. 
Like she says she don't even love her fans because I don't know y'all. And I get it because you don't know these people, but you got to have love for people that support you, right? That's that's what I would argue. Like I don't have to know my subscribers. I love y'all. Y'all y'all keep me going. Y'all motivate me. Even the haters. I love the haters too. At the end of the day, you're supposed to love all at the end of the day. Um, you can tell she's not a Christian or, I mean, I'm not a Christian either, so. But you can tell she, I don't know, what the hell does this girl believe in? Because didn't they say a few while back that she got a tattoo that allegedly was on some sick, twisted, demonic shit? I don't know. Y'all drop a comment. Let me know. All right. So, the fan didn't respond. And we don't know you, but we have supported you through thick and thin. Woo! This fan is pissed off. Mind you, you'll be nothing without us. Time out. Um, I want to stop the fan. I mean, I did agree to a certain extent like your fans are the reason why you know you're, you're successful because they support you and they spend money on your records etc but without doja cat there will be no doja cat like it it starts she's the seed and the fans kind of just you know water it and plant it and, and check on it and help it grow you know and so i don't want i don't want y'all to think i agree with that part because I, I definitely disagree with that You'll be working at a grocery store making songs on fucking garage band, Miss High School Dropout. Stop. This is another thing that's weird, too. And this is probably why she had to check some of y'all fans. Kittens. How can you say that she'll be nothing without y'all and call her a, college, a high school dropout and saying that she'll be working at a grocery store? What kind of fit? That's not fan. That's, that's a hater. Anybody that throws some things at you? To hurt your feelings? Come on now. So, eh, you gotta go. You're definitely not a fan. Doja Cat responds. Nobody forced you. I don't know why you're talking to me like you're my mother, bitch. You sound like a crazy person. Listen, I agree. I agree. Um, I feel like you should definitely check your fans. Um, If I had some super crazy fans that was on some super crazy shit, I would definitely tell them, listen, y'all on some super crazy shit. Y'all need to stop that shit because you fucking shit up for me. Um, Doja Cat, since then, shout out to Say Cheese, since then lost 250,000 followers and counting. Because, um, Breakfast Club said she lost 500k, so shout out to them. Um, she tweeted this. Well, this is actually an Instagram. Seeing all these people unfollow me makes me feel like I've defeated a large beast that's been holding me down for so long. And it feels like I can reconnect with people who really matter and love me for who I am and not who I was. I feel free! Listen, shout out to Doja Cat. I 100% I agree. I feel like if you're a real supporter of someone, it's kind of like family. You're going to ride with your family, right or wrong. You're going to be with them through thick and thin, through sickness and up. And I, and hopefully that there's nothing wrong with her. But I do feel like she has something that's a little loose up there. So, um, yeah, ho hopefully she gets the thoughts. I mean, the help that she needs. I hit that subscribe button. I'm out.